Interesting story that goes behind this, and Joe B is going to tell you about how we ended up finding out a song of ours was making money before they even told us that it had been recorded. <laughs> we were in fact practicing late at night in the garage with Buddy's uncle, Larry. Cousin or uncle? Larry's my brother. <laughs> well, I always wondered. And you weren't supposed to tell you those stories, you know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I did. Well, you feel bad at Larry if you keep it talking like that. Anyhow, we was practicing, and one night we got a call from a radio station in New York City. There was some DJ, and he got hold of one of Buddy's tunes that we'd all recorded and send it off. We didn't send it to him, sent it to somebody else. He'd been playing it for 48 hours. Can you imagine a radio station doing that today? 48 hours straight. People was calling in and saying, I want to hear it again. Who's that artist? Who is it? So when the phone rang, they were saying, you boys better get off to New York City, a place I'd never even dreamed of going to. And this here's the tune that kind of kicked it all off for us in a big way. Charlie's one, he shot it 